Hi, my name's Ian with VP Toolkit. In this video, I'm going to show you how to update your VP Toolkit plugin from an older engine version to a newer engine version. We're going to be doing 5.2 to 5.3, uh, so let's get started. So first, you'll want to make a project for your 5.3 update or whatever your latest engine version is. This should be the same across most engine versions. So if you're going from one to two or two to three or whatever in the future, uh, this should be pretty much the same. First, you want to make a project. This is just a standard ICBFX project. And then I've added a plugins folder to the project root. And then I'm going to copy the latest release of the VP Toolkit plugin for engine 5.3 and paste that into the plugins folder of my 5.3 project. Now you wanna make sure that you extract that first before you copy it and put it into your plugins folder. So now this video is already assuming that you have a setup in 5.2 and you're looking to bring your stage configuration and project files over to the new plugin so that you don't have to reset up your stage. So we're gonna open the old engine version project. So in your older engine version, you're going to want to go to plugins, VP toolkit content. If you don't see the plugin content, go to your settings in your content browser and make sure that show plugin content is enabled. So we're going to go to content and then we're going to select the user folder. We'll select migrate. We're going to unselect everything but the users folder. Okay. And then we're going to go to VP toolkit plugin. So we're going to go to your 5.3 project, go to plugins, VP toolkit studio plugin, and then go in the content folder. Select that folder. If you've made any custom camera formats, you'll also have to migrate those in the same way. You created a user lens profile, uh, you may have to migrate that into the new plugin as well. And the same thing, you'll want to only migrate that user folder not any of the VP Toolkit assets from this engine version. Now that we've migrated our user assets over to the 5.3 version, we can now open up the instance of Unreal in 5.3. So once you're in Unreal Engine 5.3, you can go to Levels, and then we can select a stage level. We'll select the stage level that we had brought over, set up stage, and then we're going to assume that it contains an end display config because it already had one in there when we set it up. And I'm just going to name this setup 5.3, or you could name this something to do with your studio name, and then you would use this config uh, from there on out. We're going to build levels. And then we're just going to add the environment level. We're just going to use one of the curve stage again. And there we have our stage configuration from our other project now in this version of the plugin. If you need help setting up your stage or working on an in camera VFX virtual production, let us know. Reach out. We're here to help. I hope that was useful, and I'll see you in the next one.